Yo, what is up guys? It's Mike Sturzum. Welcome back to the channel. Today we're trying to be just a tad bit louder. I did put up the volume on Resident Evil since I've been doing the last videos and I noticed how horrible and low the sound sounds. So I put it up and uh, I'm going to talk louder because I say this every time. Every time I edit, I'm like, I need to talk louder and then I don't talk louder. So hopefully I actually do it today. Okay, so we are back with Resident Evil 2. I already have a lot of videos ready. I think I have like 9 or something. So this should be episode 10. I already have a lot of videos ready. I just wanted to do this one because I was watching Resident Evil last night. Uh, some gameplay. And I was really wanted to play. So I'm going to just get one episode off my chest real quick. Alright, more of that stuff. Okay, let's... Um, I like to load the game because, like, there's just subtle time differences sometimes. Like, look at this one. This shows a uh, generator room and this shows break room. Like, there's that subtle time difference, you know? It just helps a little, right? I think so. Last time, we just found a way back up from the downstairs place. But before I start, do hit that subscribe button down below and that notification icon so you do keep up to date with my videos. I do upload three times a week. I'm trying to go for five. Uh, so far this week that I'm recording this on, uh, so basically last week for any guys watching on the actual date that it releases. Also comment down below if you have any videos you guys like to see or any video games you guys like to see me play. Alright, so last time I was looking to look at the map. The map is so important. So last time, if I am correct, so we came back upstairs through this place with the crank which we have here or not I guess we lose the crank so we had to find another one that is very unfortunate because I thought we could use the crank for another thing that <sighs> well damn and I left this green herb in the generator room I don't know why I have like so much space I don't know, I'm just, uh, let me move it, there you go. Alright, so, yeah, and then it leads up here to this room. So, I just went to this typewriter real quick. Then I'm going to go through here and open this door, hopefully. So, let's go out. Uh, is this the right way? No, this leads to another place. Did I even look in here before? Uh, I guess so. Oh. Remember these? It's kind of a waste of ammo, but I wonder what it gives you. Oh, well, then again, I'd probably put some stuff in the deposit box. That's why. Ah, oh, shit! Okay, I'm gonna run past them now. I'm gonna start putting up barricades here. Yeah, let's just go past them for now. And this, I don't have it. Oh, wait, these are scissors. Uh, I think, okay. Yeah, I don't have this. Did I put it away or something? Uh, let's walk back so that guy doesn't notice us. Those people in the window are gonna get in. Yeah, that I put a fuse, that fuse away. I could have sword last time, didn't I find a fuse? Oh, look at the tool here. I put it back in. Car key, the electronic part, some mag ammo, electrical part. I don't know why I put it away. Okay, they still haven't gotten through. I don't need this guy to notice me. Though he probably will. Once this thing opens. This guy's still alive? Come on, come on, come on! How's the body get eaten alive? Come on, man. I'm gonna go through this office. Did I leave anything here that I can get? No, I already got everything from here. <clears throat> Alright. And we are back to the safe room. Beautiful, I like it. Though, I still don't like that this door is open. 
but I'm pretty sure this place is 100% safe. I'm pretty sure. So now that we have the crank, um, I forgot where it was, but we can go there now. And also, I can go to this uh, this place real quick. And what what else did we get? We got the uh, diamond key, right? Okay, and I got some boards here. I think I'm going to finally start using some boards. Okay, so I need this tool. I finally got a knife after all this damn time. Uh, I'm sorry, I have this tool. Uh, this car key is used downstairs. I'm going to take this roll of film. I'm going to need that. Electronic part. Okay. Also, I'm going to start... Um, I'm going to take everything, all the items that are key items, and I'm going to examine them. The scepter. Um, what else? I think that's basically all this I have. Right. This, this thing, I already expected, inspected it, but whatever. Uh, mag ammo. This is also a key item. Okay. Right. So I'm going to go and inspect all these items. Let's start with this button. Though I did examine it last time. It's a keypad. It's, it's a spare key. You see, before it said a spare part, but now I know it's a spare key. So that all makes sense now. I know exactly where to put it. This, I'm, I already know where it is. It's a square crank, okay? It just says tool, okay? It's, that belongs to something with a square shape. I hope that other one's square shape. Examine, uh, 3F locker. Okay, so it shows me the for the locker on the third floor. So I need to get that. Um, where, what is a locker on the third floor? Oh, this, dial lock, okay. What else? Okay, next, this. Okay, a uh, shirt staff with a jewel in it. We can do this, and we get the jewel. A pricey looking gemstone. Are we gonna be able to sell stuff now? Is we gonna have currency? What? All right, I don't know. This car key, which I've already looked at many times. It says 7439 for, for some reason. <gasps> that makes sense, okay. I, I didn't um, look at it when I was down there and the only way down there is going all the way through there again because I think it closed but uh, examine this is just gonna show me hey it's a diamond key and examine I'm pretty sure I exam oh power panel custom part for the yeah well we already kind of knew that we need to find the other part where I think he said the clock tower if I'm correct yeah I I, I don't I don't remember. Give me a second. Yeah, look for uh, generator room. Uh, clock. Yeah, clock tower. So the second one's in the clock tower. Uh, so for now we're gonna go real quick into the safety deposit room, and I uh, and I'm gonna put that button in, and we're gonna see what we can do with it. Though I know we can't get the bag because it needs both buttons. So let's do that. I guess I'm. Uh, I'll meet you there. Oh crap! Dang it. Come on, guys. This is not fair. This is not fair. Also, um, I did notice... Uh, let me... I... Also, I did notice that... Um, remember I was talking about the suits? Uh, I think in, like, episode 3, because I just edited it. Right, um, I I didn't notice. I was actually watching something last night. Oh wait, yeah, alternate. I didn't. Even... I think that's how it looked in the original. All right, but um, you can actually put nor. So if you put nor, it asks you if you want to put the special screen filter, which I did not notice. I was watching um, somebody play last night, and I noticed that they put on the nor stat 
thing and it asks them if they want to put on the thing. So here we go. We actually have this freaking Nor costume. Beautiful. All right, now let's get rid of this damn thing. Actually, we can reload real quick. There you go. That was very useful. All right, uh, I guess we could put it on any one. I guess, if anything, I'll put it on two. Yeah, I'll put it on two for now because at least I could use the second side now. All right, so I can get, let's see, 208, that's it. <laughs> and I think there's something on 102 also. Mm, some gunpowder. 208 and 102. I get it. And 102. Okay, now I need three so I can get 203, which is the pouch. Uh, so I need that last one. And also three to get 103, which is a knife. Very useful. I hate those damn liquors. <laughs> oh, goodness. Yeah. All right. Okay, so we got some shots for this now. I have one bullet left. Oh, sorry. Well, I had one bullet left. I just put it in my gun. They're both dead. Okay, I'm gonna go in here and I'm gonna use this roll of film. And it is DCM. So I guess we can go up there now and do that. And I like that because it kind of goes away and now it becomes a, uh, what do you call it? I don't, I don't know. Uh, should I get something from here? Let me put this away. Store. Uh, I still have this. Alright. I don't know what the gemstone is for right now, so I'm just going to put it in there. It says key item. But I guess you put it somewhere. You're gonna need it eventually. I don't know. I guess, right? Because that's how everything works here. All right. Uh, next, where the heck is this, this crank key go? Also, we have the diamond keys. So yeah, I'm pretty sure it goes up here. So it goes where the in the waiting room. And something else I didn't notice. Uh, I remember. I don't remember what episode, but I came in here and there was a freaking fire zombie. That was because of the explosion here. They turned into zombies. And they were on fire. And that's why they're here. And I never really, like, I just, like, I was, I was just like, okay, yeah, no, I'm, I'm done. <laughs> All right, and this is a diamond door, so we can go in there now, too. And you can actually unlock this from the back way. Yeah. If I really want to go through all that. I mean, either way, this is probably something important in there if it needs a freaking key. But, um, and then this, I guess it would lead to the second floor. Yep, and then you'll be at the balcony. Okay, so it's, I've been 15 minutes in about. So, if anything, I'm going to go to this room right quick. And while I'm here, I'm going to put in this dialogue. I'm um, going to get these shotgun shells, go through, unlock this door, put the linen key in, unlock this door, and then go through and come back down. All right? All right. I guess I'll meet you there. Because I'm already, I'm already here on the first floor. All I got to do is go up the stairs. Actually, I was looking at the wrong place, but whatever. Uh, wait. Right? Yeah, no, I was thinking it's this dialogue here. So I'm gonna get this dialogue and I'm gonna go back down to the second floor. So this one was what again? Mm, TCM. D C M. What's in here? How much space I have? I have a lot. Okay. 
magnum ammo, which I already got some, so... But I don't have a magnum yet. I need the, uh... What do I need? I need the USB to get the magnum ammo, because I'm pretty sure... Uh, that's the magnum pass there. Why would they give me another handgun? I don't know. Yeah, so it doesn't really make sense. So this is where I need to go, actually. Of course, there's somebody there. Uh, there's this on the floor, which I totally ignored the first time. I think there was a zombie there, that's why, or something. I don't know. Uh, so let me reload this weapon real quick. Um, hopefully I can walk right by her. Or not. Uh, let's see. What was there here? Uh, shotgun shells. All right, let's just walk right past. Is there anything? Oh yeah, that's that's another one. All right. Okay, so now I just need to go around there, unlock this door, which I'm pretty sure is the lock from this side, and this diamond door. Are you alive? I don't think so, right? Isn't that the one we killed last time? Yeah, it looks like it's trying to, like, dance. I don't know what is going on there. <laughs> what the fudge? All right. Uh, let's see. See, this door has this lock on it. Again, I found this out from watching uh, some people play last night. I didn't watch too far. I just watched, like, a good, like, two hours into... Into gameplay, which I am, but, like... Even that, like, sometimes you just miss, like, small things and stuff. Another one of these. Yay. What was in the first one? I forgot already. I wonder if it's the same code. Alright. Let's examine this. God dang it, where is it? Dang it! There you go. Alright, we got the other priest. Yes, yes. Let's go back down there now. And yeah, okay. So. So we can go back down this way. Uh, and yeah, because we can just go back down this way. Or we can go to the library, go through there, go. I think the library would be. Slightly faster. I don't know. Let's, let's just do it this way. Okay, so we're gonna go down here. I love that shotgun on his back. Okay, we're gonna go through here. I just came through here, so I don't think there should be any zombies around, but then again. <laughs> Crap. He noticed me. Don't notice me, senpai. <laughs> Goodness. All right. So, yeah, right there. Let's do 203. Sorry, not that. Back. No. 203. Enter. And 103. Enter. All right. No, wait, yeah, we're done. Okay. So, 103. We got another knife. Come on. I didn't think we were going to find it so soon. We could have just made one run here. But whatever. Come on. And a hip pouch. Whoop whoop. Alright. So we got more space now. And I feel like this guy's about to come in here, no? Just run past him. 
Just run past them. All right, we're back again. Marvin. Oh no. I had a feeling. Okay. God damn it, Marvin! You move too much. God dang it. Stop this, Lieutenant. I promise. All right. Let's reload this. Okay, let's put this gunpowder in. Um, I'm gonna keep the extra knife just because. And I don't need this car key right now. Oh, this we can already throw out. This I can store for now. This I can store for now. Okay, so let's. Discard this. I don't need it anymore. Okay, so the last place I'm going to go today, I think I have some time, is to open this upstairs. Could this... No, I'm looking in the underground facility. Come on. Come on. I don't know why it has two maps, but let's go. Shop here. Um, this place. And this will lead me, get me into the chef's op chief's office. And also lead me, I think it goes either upstairs. I think it goes both upstairs and downstairs. So it's going to unlock a big area. But what I just want to do today, I'm going to get this and I'm going to explore this little corner here. Because uh, I'm almost like, yeah, I already have like a good amount of time on this. I really like all about to be like in this area now. Watch me come back down. He's alive again. I just feel like this should be like a way to get back down there again. Whatever. All right. So here we are with the uh, crank. Let's do this. All right. So like I said, I'm only going to explore the first uh, second floor. I'm not really going to go downstairs or upstairs for now. waste up a bullet but we can't go into this door we need the heart key uh <laughs> you know what then i'm gonna go back and i guess we'll do this next time are you gonna get back good my boy you better not all right i wonder if there's anything in this like area that can help me or something like can i look at his laptop oh the the laptop he took and like check the security cameras and stuff okay let's save the oh i mean let's save the game real quick like i said it's just that split second difference between that <coughs> that auto save and you know just like like why all right and we don't need the crank for anything else so we'll get rid of that And you can't actually get rid of any other items, so it's, a, it's all good anyway. And I have a lot of space now, so that is very good. Okay, guys, so I'm going I'm to end it here. Subscribe down below. Hit that notification icon to keep up with my videos. I am doing three uploads a week, and I am trying to go for five this week. Again, I'm doing good so far. And uh, hit the like button down below if you didn't enjoy the video. And... Uh, to show your appreciation for the channel and Resident Evil 2. And also comment down below for any uh, videos you guys like to see or any games you guys like me to play in the future. Like I said, I will be uh, live streaming on Saturdays. So also link down in the description to that if you want to go check that out. And um, I guess I'll see you guys next time. Which again, I'm probably going to record this today. Bye bye. <laughs>